I started out the Army in uh, Fort Drum, New York, back in 86. And the cold weather gear they gave us at Fort Drum, New York then, and the cold weather gear that you get at Fort Drum, New York now is a world of difference. I think the Gen 3 is the most useful and comfortable cold weather system that the Army has ever issued me. This is a nice interchangeable system, keeps me completely warm, sir. I've, I've worn it out negative 40 and I was perfectly fine. It doesn't obstruct your movement when you're trying to do operations or you're trying to work with your hands or run somewhere. Uh, so it does a real good job of that because it's thin and it, it does an excellent job keeping you warm as well. The Generation 3 Extended Cold Weather Clothing System is comprised of seven layers or, or, and 12 components to make up those seven layers from the silk weight underwear to the next higher weight underwear to layer three, which is a, a fleece jacket, to layer four, which is then an outer shell, all the way up to layer seven, which is what we call the loft layer. And that's what gets you to the minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit. All of these pieces of equipment can be worn individually or collectively together so you can stack and wear your clothing as needed for the, for the cold weather. The seven layer system allows you to mix and match to what's necessary so that you can achieve optimal performance and stay warm and comfortable and alive. There are ways that you can, of course, peel off more and more clothing or find other ways to cool down to remain operationally effective. It's the, the full range of our operational environment that the soldiers can wear this in a modular capacity. You can set your watch by the locals in Afghanistan, or well, the enemy, the enemy locals, I should say. As soon as it gets cold outside, they're not moving because they figure, you know, it's cold. Why am I going to go out in it? We would sit out on our overwatching positions for weeks, you know, perfectly content, other than the fact you haven't had a shower, just as warm as can be. And you see the average local coming by, just wrapped up as much as he can be in his sheet, just shivering. You know, I'm, I'm good. We'll, we'll stay for a while. I would really like to see uh, this system continue to be used. I want my soldiers to have the best equipment possible in order to go out and defend this nation where we need to.